Uh, we're just going to have a bit of a talk about some of our favourite rod and reel combos, about uh, what we use them for, what we think they're good at, and um, yeah, just have a bit of a chat about them. Uh, these are two of our favourite combos here. We've got the Azores Blue reels matched up on the Fresh Point rods. Uh, they're both P2 to 4 rods. This one's a little bit shorter. This one's 7 foot, that's 7 6. This one's good. We use it for like dropping heavier plastics or dropping plastics down for going out deep, or it's a really awesome rod for casting stick baits. And um, yeah, this one here, a little bit longer rod, a little bit littler reel. We've got lighter line on it. It's good for casting a smaller little stick baits and that along flats. Really good casting rod. Um, they're good for plastics as well, anything really. It's just one of my favorite all round rods. Uh, next combo we're going to be talking about is this uh, big Azores 8000 matched up with the Azores uh, P56 rod. It's a shorter rod and it's really good for dropping. We've had this one for a fair while, almost two or three years I think. And I've um, been using this one for mostly just bottom dropping and stuff like that. It's uh, awesome. We've been dragging around for ages, chucking the boat, chucking the car. It's just a super tough rod and reel. We've got so much grunt for dragging out the big fish off the bottom. Use it up for long time, some big sharks, big reds, all sorts of big fish on this road, unreal. This here, this is a metalloid, this is a 12S reel and a PE46 rod. This is our biggest one. We use these for trawling, we caught marlin, wahoo, dolphin fish, um, tuna. Put heaps of plastic straw with them. We also use these for bottom dropping, like big plastics, jigs, and big baits. NWA, we used to use these. We used to have run two hooks on them. We caught heaps of double headers, heaps of big, massive fish pulling up from about 80 meters. It's just an awesome rod for that. Just got so much power. Uh, this is the lightest of the three Cirrus road combos we've got. So this is the Cirrus matched up with a Helios 30. Uh, this is an awesome little combo. It's a bit of a lighter one for creek fishing and it's not quite heavy enough to go out and chase bottom drop or anything like that, but it's an awesome little rod, awesome creek fishing rod. Got barra, big jacks, everything. This is an awesome creek fishing rod, awesome for casting underneath the mangroves and landing them. This here, this is a Cirrus rod, 8 to 15 kg. This here is a Zorz Blue Reel, 4,000. This here, this is an awesome rod. You take it up creeks, still go out the front and chase tuna and all that with it. It's an awesome rod. These rods are so good for casting. You can use them for bottom dropping. They still got a bit of stick. They're bloody awesome. Uh, this here, this is a Cirrus Blue So Mitchell here, he's got a Cirrus rod, um, 5 to 12 kg. This is similar to the one I had before, but this one's got a Helios reel. There's still just an awesome rod, all-round rod. You can cast in creeks, go out the front, chase tuna, stuff with it, Trevally. Hemp, great rod. We've bashed this one around so much. It's a bloody tough rod, awesome. Just one of my favourites. This is a Cirrus baitcaster combo. This is a 4 to 8 kg rod. This is my favorite creek rod here because I actually caught a meter 25 barrel on this here. Awesome for casting creeks. Just an awesome rod. Feel great in your hand. Bloody awesome for casting under mangroves. Little light lures and that. But you still cast the bigger lures with this as well. <laughs> 